Hey there, welcome back. We are the Pilkingtons of Harrenhal. Lord Ricky of Harrenhal, named after Ricky Gervais. Sadly, Carl Pilkington I of Harrenhal died. And I'm not a genius, which is even worse. I don't think any of his kids were geniuses. We had a quick one. Yes. I legitimised the bastards because... Yeah, they're awesome. We need more males in this house. Wait, what? He's a Rivers. Tyressa had a Joseph Rivers and we can't legitimise him because our father was dead. Ugh. Anyway, let's... Um, so, I was going to show you this, the ledger. So, I don't know whereabouts you can find it. Oh, that's pretty cool. You can tell her, like, who has the biggest religions and stuff. So, I'm going to be... Yeah, that's pretty cool. Uh, Merchant Prince... Right, so who has the most gold in the world? The Ark, Maester, 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 Lord Ricky Harnell. I'm, I'm pretty rich. Lord Paramount. So is there any way I can see ladies? Is there any ladies going that are quite rich? Is any, any ladies at all? Is this only men or something? Your dynasty, your direct vassals, all vassals in realm. I have rich people in my realm. Ah. Lady. Right. Uh. Alright, so do show the ladies. So, my idea here, if it was a bit more easy, I could just search for women's to invite to our court or marry to our people, but looks like it's going to be quite hard, to be honest. Yeah. There's all ladies and lords. See, she's got money. But she's, like, married and stuff. Right. Yeah, it doesn't look like this is actually going to work. Especially since we're getting to poorer people now. There's still no one unlanded. Right, there's a sir. So, Riger of Fair Market. Oh. Well, whatever. Wait, that was another sir, but he's probably a lord, yeah. Looks like they're all lords. Counts and, yeah, look, lady landed. So it should be people not landed in these, but it doesn't seem like that's an option. Your court. Who has the most gold in my court? Okay. Independent states, wars, possible inheritances. I'm the heir to a couple of Castles, cool our titles, our claimants. So I have claims on several pieces of land. Very good. Demence realm, your realm levies and care religions. Right, so the thing I wanted does not exist. I wanted to find women with loads of money, marry into my guys, and hope they did something illegal that we could arrest them and take their gold. So it looks like I'm going to be a very diplomatic ruler. Indeed. I'm going to be the most diplomatic fellow going. Betrothed to Lolliston. Ah, she'll do. She's, like, the diplomat as well. Alright then. So let's... What's this? Decide upon Civil War size. What's the Civil War? So you guys are in it. I am not... So let's... Go ahead and support the throne. Which will make us independent from you. But we're not going to do anything. Is anyone else... Wait, he has the reach on his side. And Driftmark, who I can't get to. But he does have the reach where I could get. can even go for the Roxton Sword. You have to be Ironborn, don't you? How do you do it? I don't think there's any safe way I'm going to be able to go down here and siege out something. It's hardly worth anything for all that trouble. These aren't worth. So the place is worth a lot to be over here. Which I could siege if I got there. Hmm. Would I be able to get through their forces? In fact, it looks like these guys might even be able to win. Yes. You and you versus uh, the north. Not even the whole north, there's like hardly anyone up there. 
You know what, it looks like the Reach and the other guys have this sorted, to be honest. If they, especially if they've got another stack. They're going to suffer attrition here, though. That's going to cost them. Right. We've only got 5,000 men. We're not going to be able to make a difference anywhere, are we? Especially if the AI wants to... Uh, go down in shipments and get slaughtered. Which they apparently do. At least they're losing like a 1,000 men... Odd per turn and all that. Right, what are we going to do? Uh, just see, I don't think I can actually go over and siege. Wait, this guy gets grayscale. Oh, shame for that guy. Wait, she has both now. Can't be having both. It's just so barbaric. Okay, that thing in my in my throat is really messing me about right now. I don't. F just feels it feels like I constantly need to have a hiccup in my in my ch the higher chest of my throat. I don't know what's going on. But so I think this might only be a ten video recording. So I'll end after these four. Yeah, because it's getting irritating. I can't really feel like I need to have a up. It's crazy. Can improve my castle. We're not going to. We are busy. Kings Road. So it gives us tax income, supply limits, and movement speed. That's cool. Harren Hall Castle. Cannon Castle gives us fort level. Whoa. Okay, well at least we're actually reinforcing our levies. So we could actually fight correctly if something happens. Ah, good, I'm a Roth. Just what I wanted. Learn my diplomacy, though. Ah, I did like my diplomacy. I also like my money. We need to get up to 800. Come on. 800 gold without a family dying off. Wait, what? Oh, yeah, Wilbert died. He died. Charles, so Carlton needs an educator. Let's get him combat ready. Go to Smallwood. Also improves his relations. So There's another 100 men. Oh, most have died. Probably with grayscale, seeing as he had grayscale. Unfortunately, that's money to be spent. Ah. Ah, mother's my regents. What well a mother. Just don't give away my land to my other kid. Or brother. So the maester, eh, he is awesome. And he had a father. Okay. But he's a very good maester. What is wrong with my throat right now on my chest? What the hell? Your new Lord Commander, Orme. Ah, I remember you from my Reach playthrough. Your relative was murdered on the orders of your other relative. Okay, Orme's. You seem to be having fun. But yeah, these guys, they're going to win. So they're going to put a black fire on the throne. What? His going on here? But they just want a black fire on the throne. Shame I couldn't get down here and siege anything. Shame all their forces are over in Pike. Is their lord in Pike? Because if they manage to siege him out right at the end, that would be very funny. Nope. They are wasting their time, but stupid AI does not care one bit. You look different. Still no claimants to any of your land. Dario, I, I want to be the claimants. Give me a claim, please, fellows. While I hang about here. In fact, is anyone from... Wait. Hang on. What's going on with Lolliston? Any of your family want to come over? No. Anyone from the border want to come over and help me be in my court? Apparently not. Brimbrook. Ah. Any Peckledons? Any of you guys? Ah, this is crazy. No one wants to join me. Yeah, but these this guy is getting smashed. The Blackfires are going to win here. 
We should make Targaryens the Lord Paramounts over here. Wild Blackfires on the throne. Okay. That might spark some civil wars. How strong is the Blackfire line? 12 members. Ares, Arion, Aenys, that guy. Wait, what? Oh, yeah, so, yeah, they've, they've taken over. Let's hope you wait, what? No, I will suffer his... He'll decide my fate. Your, you shall be allowed to return to your lands unmolested and be pledged to uphold the king's peace forthwith. As a guarantee is pledged, a hostile from your family will be taken. Right, so... My brother and heir is now over there, and... Okay. And we're now fighting the north. <laughs> also, the dynamic flag, so that's now the Iron Thrones flag. Is everyone fighting the north? Only the Lannisters and the river, but yeah, it looks like you're going to be losing the north, buddy. And your Martell grandparents, whatever. Um, support the throne. Support the throne. That make Lord Paramount Hostine like me a bit more, but do I care what he thinks? No. He's already called up my men though, so what's the point? Ah well. Could I swear filthy to you now? I could. Would this get me away from the Riverlands? If so, that'd be cool. If I can get away from the Riverlands, then I can have a better chance around these lands. Go on and come to this place. No, bitter steel. Who would come to my court? Bitter steel would come to my court. If his whole family dies off and I get a Valyrian steel sword, okay, I don't mind. Pilkington gets the Pilkington sword. Alright, so does that mean he's. Is he going to give me back to the other guys? Okay, so House Bittersteel is now my loyal vassal. And he has lots of money. And his heir is going to be betrothed to... Carlot. Matrimonial. Ah, oh, my mother needs to accept it. That would be an acceptable matrimonial if we get this sword in our house. He is rich. If he would just, like... You know, give me the sword. But yeah, I'm now on equal terms to quite a few people around here we could have a shot at. So you have a strong claim on Birch Hall, which is this guy. We can declare war for his claim on that guy. So let's get you... Under the castle of tower, castle of tower dread, and then let's try and take this castle, Birch Hall, from the Duskendale lot. He doesn't have any friends, so let's just go for it. Let's try and take that castle. We have quite a few men. He might have a few as well, but I don't know that. Let's try and get them all over here. Yeah, we have more men. We should have this sorted. Let's go. In fact, let's get you lot straight over there. Nope, he didn't catch anyone, but sure, we're getting straight into the attackers. Bitter Steel's in the King's Guard. But I have his son, the actual heir to the sword, and he's still leading my armies here. Alrighty then. Let's just get all my forces to the castle we're trying to siege. Where are you, Woodmere? Alright, so we got. We got a bit of steals. Wait, what? Didn't mean to click on that. We got better steel. Hopefully their house will die out and I will get a sword. That'd be just... I love it. If I get their Valyrian steel sword, that'd be terrific. At least if I get it in my house. I mean, if the child of the bitter steel, Junior and the... The Pilkington gets a sword after he dies and that wouldn't exactly makes sense, but yeah, that'd be cool. So let's just um, war this guy and take this land then. So someone has no air uh, or claimants. No, it is your land. You don't have anyone yet. 
Mars, bruh, no one. See, this land, there'd be a lot more to eat through than over here. I mean, you could just take away all of that, but that's just, you know. Which means we should really get our fabricator of claims moved. She still has a dragon egg as well. Let's get you fabricating claims on Renet. So, alright, castle. But yeah, I'm, I'm happy we got bitter steels. Not very cannon or what have you, but I'm happy. Wait. So, War for Northern Independence, they have the veil on their side. Alright. So, we can imprison that guy. Why? Besides the reason he's useless, it cost me to send him to the wall. Also, I could probably siege out a lot of land here. Because I have ambitions on rebuilding Harren Hall, sieging land and taking money would be very nice. We have two equal sized stacks, but first, his army is sort of in the way. Hopefully, I can avoid it altogether. Oh, I'm bitter still. He was married to a Blackfire, okay. Well, at least I have got his son. House Bitter Steel is mine. I could use Landum. I can choose the Marion Sun for claims on the Iron Throne. Even though they'll be weak and I won't be able to take them because too strong. Hopefully their army won't come through me or anything like that. I can raise up more men. Oh yeah, the guy I landed. Ah, extra 26. What's the harm in that? 26 men are very useful. Oh, well, there's 15 gold. Let's get you guys onto antlers. Which we can. Next one we might be able to have split up my men. First we'll arrive in antlers. And we'll see what we can do. I really want my gold. If I could have imprisoned Bitter Steel and got rid of him, that would have really helped. Imprison her, please. Yes! Get in. Too bad I can't do anything about it. Could ransom her, but I would rather have one of her castles. Let's be honest, castles are much better. So let's split these guys up. Yeah, that's near enough perfect. Egor, bit of steel, you're going over to this castle. You should be able to siege. Of course he can. Yeah, it's just me being just crazy. But he's going to Brindlewood. So let Agor defend against when did it arrive? 13 for me. Let Agor defend against them. We're coming on both flanks to support. Hopefully we won't lose too many men because we do need to siege. Yeah, we're not going to be siege it, are we? When do you guys arrive? 27th. If Church can marry, I can get married! Let's do it. Marry into Lady Lolliston. I'm humble, rough. I'm sure I'll enjoy it. But yeah, here we go. That should be these guys getting slaughtered. Excellent. So I now have a wife. I'm married. Hopefully they'll give me a dowry. Give me your money. 25 gold. Uh, important decisions. Host a wedding feast. No. I want child who lacks education. So we'll get her educated by someone random. Who cares? Yeah, he's lost quite a few men. That's a shame because I needed them. Not only are they made personal levy, but I wanted on siege. Wait, we killed someone. He died. Died by Lord Oscar, so... Oh, Osfried, I mean. So who's over here? Less. So you're going to stay here, and you're going to go over there. Wait, now you can't even... Ah, oh, come on. How about Hollard Hall? Nope. Their capital, yeah. Go to the capital then. We've already got 100%. But I do want to see you this stuff. But that'll be for next episode. I'll see you guys then. Goodbye.